How great, how how great, how great you stand. How great, sing with me. And how great, how great, how great is our God. How great, how great, how great, how great, how great, how great, how great is our God. How great, how great. This is Rev. Michelle Hopkins. Genesis 2 And they are being completed, the heavens and the earth, and all the host of them. And he is finishing, Elohim, in day the seventh, work of him which he did. And he is ceasing in day the seventh from all of work of him which he did. He is blessing Elohim day of the seventh, and he is making holy himself, because he ceased from all of work of him, which he created Elohim, bringing to pass the accomplishment of these genealogical annals of the heavens and the earth in the process of creation in day to bring forth Yahweh Elohim, self-existent one, eternal God of gods, earth and heavens. And any of shrub of the field, ere he is becoming in earth, and of any herbage of the field, ere he is sprouting, that not he caused rain, Yahweh Elohim, on the earth and human none to work the ground. And humidity he is ascending from the earth, and he furnished a potion to all faces of the ground. And he is forming Yahweh Elohim, the human, soil from the ground. And he is blowing in nostrils of him breath divine alive, and he is becoming the human, a breathing creature, soul alive, and he is planting, Yahweh Elohim, Garden of Eden from east, and he is placing there the human whom he formed. And he is causing sprout, Yahweh Elohim, from the ground, every tree being coveted to sight and good for food, and tree of life in the midst of the garden, and tree of the knowledge of good and evil, and streaming forth from Eden to irrigate the garden, and from there it is being parted and became four heads. Name of the one, Pishon. It is the one surrounding all of the land of the Chat Vila, the eastern regions, which there the gold, and the gold of the land, it good there, the pearl and the stone of gem and name of the stream the second, Gikon, it, the one surrounding all of the land of Cush, and the name of the stream the third, Hidekel, it, the one going east of Ashur, and the stream the fourth, it Peroth, the Euphrates. And he is taking Yahweh Elohim, the human, and he is allowing him to stay in the Garden of Eden, to serve in her and to attend her. And he is thoroughly instructing Yahweh Elohim, the human, saying from any tree of the garden to eat, you shall eat and from the tree of the knowledge of good and evil, from it not you shall eat. In day eat of you from it, it shall cause death, 
you shall die. And he is saying, Yahweh Elohim, not good to exist the human apart from his own. I shall make for him aid, counterpart, a mate. And he is forming Yahweh Elohim from the ground, every animal of the field, as well as every flyer of the heavens. And he is bringing to the human to see what he shall call to him. And all which he is calling to him, the human soul living, he name him. And he is calling the human names. And to all the beast and the flyer of the heavens and to every animal of the field. And for Adam not existed aid, counterpart, a mate. And he is causing to fall, Yahweh Elohim, stupor on the human, and he is sleeping. And he is taking one from the angulars of him, a rib, and he is closing the flesh underneath. And he is building, Yahweh Elohim, of it the rib which he took from the human, a woman. And he is bringing her to the human. And he is saying, the human, this, the once bone from bones of me and flesh from flesh of me, to this shall be called woman. That from man she was taken, this one. And so he is leaving man, the father of him and the mother of him, and he clings in woman of him and they become to flesh one. And existed two of them, naked ones, the human and the woman of him, and not they shaming selves. This is Rev. Michelle Hopkins. Thank you for watching, and God bless you.